hello everybody welcome back so today i'm going to show you top five free ai image generators in this video so this is why i'm doing this one because i promised you in the last video that if i get enough comments i'm going to do this and i got over a hundred comments of people saying that they wanted this tutorial on how to create free ai images and of course i'm fulfilling my promise the second reason why i'm doing this video is because i had people tell me that oh they had issues using the ai tool that i I showed them how to use in the previous video. Some said it was code issues. Some said it was trying to log in. Some said, you know, there were different issues. And I said, okay, the easiest and the best way to sort out these issues is to have alternatives. So if this one is not working, you can, of course, switch and start using the other one. And that is the purpose of this video. If you're here, you are welcome. You're about to have an amazing ride. I'm going to show you shocking applications and websites that can generate ai images that you did not know before guess what these are some tools that you've already been using for a while but you didn't know that these tools could also create ai images let me shock you so of course i've seen so many beautiful ai images that you guys have created and i am super amazed and impressed you guys blew my mind so before we get straight into this video if you are wondering what i'm talking about previous video previous video it means you're not part of the family it means you just stumbled on this video but that's fine you're welcome i love to welcome you and i'm so excited that you made it to my channel so join the family right now by clicking on the subscribe button click on the subscribe button and of course give this video a thumbs up no don't give it a thumbs up yet when i get to the end and if this video actually blows your mind do us give it a thumbs up like it comment and of course share let me show you what i have for you today so here are the five AI image generators I'm going to be teaching you today that are completely free. The first one is Microsoft Bing. I talked about this one in my previous video. I showed you how to get access to it and how to use it. So I won't be talking about it again. If you missed the video, I'm going to link it up in the description up so that you can watch it and get access to it. The video currently has about 7,000 views. That's to tell you that it was amazing. So you need to see it. I'll link it up in the description so that you can see it. The second one is Dale by OpenAI. OpenAI are the guys that made ChatGPT they are coming up with sora right now so they also have a tool called dale i'll show you how to use this one in the practical session and there's leonardo ai yes if you watch my video about how to change video backgrounds i can link it up in the description you see that i talked about leonardo ai yes it doesn't just create backgrounds you can create different kinds of ai images that you want then the shocking words do you know that canva can do ai images it's not just a graphic design tool though. you can actually use canva for ai images and then there's CapCut. Come on, let me take you on a beautiful ride and show you how you can use all these tools to make AI images. Are you ready? Let's get straight into it. So let's see how we can use Dale to generate AI images. All you have to do right now is to type D-A-L-L-E on your browser and it's going to open. The first site here is what you're going to click on and it's going to open Dale for you. So look at this. They already described it. It's an AI system that can create realistic images and art from a description in natural language. If I want to try Dale, all I'm going to do is click on try Dale. And they're going to show me how to log in and get access. All these tools will require you to log in, either with your Gmail or with your Microsoft account or with your Google account. You have to log in. So don't think you can skip this part. Somebody asked me, is there where I can skip the part of logging in? No, they need your details. That's why they're giving you all these things for free. It's more like a lead magnet. So they get your details so that they can be able to reach out to you subsequently and sell other things to you in the future. So you need to put in your details and, you know, get access to their tool. So I'm going to take a second right now to put in my password and my email address. I will get into it. Okay, so this is what Dale looks like. And guess what? You can log into Dale with the same account you use for ChatGPT. Now, here's a little issue at the moment. See, so most of these AI tools have limited access. They have limits to how many people can access them at a particular time, which is why some of you were trying to use Binge and they were saying, try again tomorrow. Yes, you might have to try again tomorrow because these tools might have been programmed to work for a specific or a maximum number of users at a particular time. Because this is what Dale is telling me right now, that they are no longer accepting new customers, right? So the paid version is available if you want to get that paid one, but the free one, Dale 2, Dale 2 is free, Dale 3 
is paid just like chat gpt there's chat gpt 3.5 that is free and there's gpt 4 or gpt plus that is paid for it's the same thing they're doing here deal 2 is free but they're no longer accepting new customers registration is now closed hopefully registration will open some other time in the future I clicked on deal 3 and this is where it brought me into here so here's what they say they said deal 3 is now available to all chat gpt plus team and enterprise users as well as to developers using our api so this means that once you subscribe to chatgpt plus which is about 20 dollars a month you get access to deal three for free do you understand so you get access to deal three which is the the upgraded version they say it represents a leap forward in ability to generate images that exactly adhere to the text you provide so according to what they are promising this is second to none they're going to give you exactly the keyword here is exactly whatever you ask the prompt or the ai to do i haven't used the three i cannot tell you for a fact if what they promised is what they delivered but let's just take their word for it so that's that about deal so we've talked about microsoft being talked about deal the third one right now is leonardo ai so i may not talk too much about this one because i already explained it in my previous video the video about changing background right i showed you how to use it all you have to do is go to your browser and type leonardo dot ai leonardo ai and look at it here so the first option is leonardo ai ads generator it creates images and more so this is what it looks like you have to either create an account or log into an existing account that you have i'm going to click on create an account So this is what the interface looks like, right? This is the interface. But what we need right now is the image generation too. You can see that this one gives you 150 credits every day. And I think you need about eight or 10 credits to generate one image. So I'm just gonna click on image generation, AI image generation. And all I have to do now is to put in the prompt and generate any kind of image that I want. Isn't this amazing? Look at this place. They say type a prompt because I don't want to take this video too long. I already talked about how to do prompts in my previous video. But your prompt is simply telling the AI exactly what you wanted to create. This is where you need to be specific. You need to be direct. You need to explain like you're talking to a four year old. You need to explain backgrounds, textures, text, attitudes, moods. Um, colors you need to give details the font everything that you want you need to tell the ai what you want so i'm just going to say give me a um, picture of a glass cup filled with milk you know in my last video i did a lot of picture of human beings so people did not know that you can actually do pictures of inanimate objects it must not be a human being right so filled with milk that's pouring out. Pouring out and forming a pool on the table. So I'm just going to click on generate. Okay, I'm going to use eight credits or eight tokens rather to generate this. Right now, they're taking eight tokens from here, and what I have left is 142. Okay, it's generating. I just want to show you what Leonardo AI can do. So these are alternatives that you can try. This is the third one on my list. We still have two more. Look at there. So this can be used for a good ad. This can be used for adverts, can be used for flyers, can be used for so many things. So all I will do is click on it and save. Which remember Leonardo AI. If this video is already making sense to you, you know what to do. Now. Say making sense, making sense, so that other people that stumble on the video know that this video is actually worth their time and they're going to click on it and watch it. That is the best form of gratitude you can give me right now. So I just saved this picture and anyone that I like, if I like all of them, I'll save them and boom, good to go. All right. So the next one I'm going to talk about, which I said is going to blow your mind, is Canva. You already know Canva. So go to canva.com. I already have it open here. This is my Canva homepage. You know that Canva has an app too. So even if you're on the app, just go to Canva on the app or Canva.com on your phone. Anywhere, it's Canva.com, right? And then log in. If you don't have a Canva account, log in, put your email address, put your password or create an account, and then you're going to get to somewhere like this. Now, this is Magic Studio. It's called Magic Studio. Now, look around your Canva application. Mine is on the left. Yours could be on the right, center, top, anywhere. 
but just look for anywhere that you're gonna see magic studio it's a new update new feature on canva and it's super amazing it literally does magic so i'm gonna click on magic studio right now and they're going to show me what they have for me so this is it meet magic studio all the power of ai all in one place magic studio brings together the best ai power tools for you and your team right inside canva magic studio is available on even the free version of canva all you have to do on your canva app is just to click on the three lines at the top left click on the three lines at the top left and your where you see magic studio projects templates brands etc so magic studio is just right there good thing you can use magic studio whether on the free version or on the paid version once you open the magic studio you read through everything watch the videos or anyone you want to try right now you go ahead and try it so all you have to do is scroll down but on your phone or your laptop just keep scrolling down until you get to the place where you see turn ideas into images and videos with magic media so once you use magic media so you see the first option text to video second option is text to image so i'm going to click on text to image and they're going to ask me if i want to try it out and i'll say yes i want to try it out click on try it out right and then it's going to open a blank document for me a blank worksheet for me on canva and it's going to ask me to put in my prompt and create whatever it is that I want to create. The left hand side right now, Magic Media. And the next thing they ask me is describe what you would like to create. Enter five words and above to describe. Right. So let me ask the exact same thing I asked Leonardo AI to do for me. And let me see uh, the kind of, let me see which one is going to be better. All right. Let me copy what I sent to Leonardo AI. Copy. And let me ask Canva to do the exact same thing. Okay, I just copied everything from Leonardo AI. Let's do a test of which one gives us the best. So I'm going to ask Canva right now to create the exact same image for me. So I'm going to enter, paste it, and click on generate image. Our images are ready. Images are ready. And this is what Canva created for me. Let's compare and contrast. I can just tap on anyone and put it on my screen to see what it looks like so this is it so you can just put it to fill out your screen and download the picture so this is the picture it has filled up my screen all i have to do is you know download the normal way you download from CapCut, sorry from canva and you are good to go and that brings us to the final one on our list which is cap CapCut is a video editing tool, amazing video editing tool that a lot of people, a lot of creators use to create amazing and stunning videos. But guess what? CapCut can also generate beautiful AI images for you. Let me show you how you can do that in simple steps. Step one, download the CapCut app from your app store or play store open it up like this now at the top you're going to see some options right photo editor text to image and lots more you're going to click on the second option which is text to image and it brings you here where you can create any kind of image at all now we're going to still use that same prompt we just want to test and see the best from all of them the prompt is a glass of milk that is pouring on the table so far we've used this prompt on canva cap cut and Leonardo AI. So as you're watching this, you can drop a comment and tell me which one you think is the best. You can also try the same prompt on Bing and then try and see what you got and then drop in the comment section which two you think that gave us the best picture out of this text. So is it Canva? Is it CapCut? Is it Leonardo AI? Is it Bing? Just let me know in the comments section. I also tell you the one I think is the best in the description. So all you have to do is type out your prompt, make sure it's detailed, make sure it's clear to understand. It's just the same format for all text to image generators. And when you're done, you see this generate button by the side, the, the white button that says generate by the side, click on it, and then it's going to take a few seconds to generate your image. While it's generating, you just wait a bit and your image will be generated. So this is my image. Yeah, generated four images for me. And all I have to do is select the one that I want and save it. If I like all of them, of course, I'm going to save all of them. 
you can also generate them in hd format you can also modify them and you can also ask CapCut ai image generator to regenerate you can see the regenerate button down there it can regenerate it for you and give you you know something better in case you feel this one is not good enough but just tap on one and this is what it looks like on a closer view just long press it and click on save if you want to download it to your gallery and that's that you can use CapCut to create beautiful ai images that you can add to your videos or just use for any other thing so that is how you can use CapCut, and then these other ai image generators all of them are free remember i told you about microsoft being i told you about the tool which is currently not accepting registrations but hopefully they might open registration soon i told you about canva i told you about CapCut. i told you about leonardo ai these are all alternatives that you can try right now to create free stunning and realistic ai images so out of all these five which one is your favorite please drop a comment and let me know which one you think gave us the best results in this video also remember that i promised you a video on how you can make money with these ai tools so if you want to see that video all you have to do is subscribe to this channel turn on the notification bell because that's the only way you're going to know when that video will drop okay i'll see you in my next video don't forget to like don't forget to drop a comment and most importantly do not forget to share this video on your whatsapp status on your facebook story on your instagram story and share the word i love you and i'll see you next time bye